being any further, let us now welcome the bridal party. To my first and last love, we have been through quite a journey to get here and in each of our lowest moments, thank you for not giving up on us. Thank you for showing me unconditional love daily. I vow to always show up for you and to have your back. Whether that requires me to learn to lead you or to humble myself to serve you and protect you. I promise to love you as your wife, to be willing to learn and grow in my relationship with God. I vow to give to you vulnerability and attention that no one else will share and to value your feedback and opinion and to make sure you're always heard. I promise to serve alongside you and to glorify God in our marriage. This promise made when I'm in love and because I am in love to be true to my beloved as long as I live commits me to being true even if I cease to be in love. From my years of the exclusive front row view of their relationship, I can honestly say there is no love quite like yours. So tender, so gentle, yet so powerful that they would urge each other to such growth. It only stands to me, God must be right there in the center, directing it all. the person I first had a crush on many years ago, but I'm even more in love with the person you are going to be. I love you and I'm absolutely excited to spend the rest of my life married to you. Eight years down, forever to go, I love you. Let me hold this side of you. I can see 